we'll guide you through how to fix a second monitor not being detected in Windows. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This problem can be annoying as you're then unable to use it. For the first fix, you need to make sure that it's properly connected. You can't have one monitor connected to the motherboard and one to the graphics card. They both need to be from the same output. So both from the graphics card or both from the motherboard. So make sure that's like that. If it is, then the next thing you can try doing is you can try changing out the cable or switching the cables around to go and test it as it could be a faulty cable. If you find that it is, you can go and get a new one and that will go and solve the problem. If that still doesn't, then what you want to try doing is right clicking on some blank space on your computer, find the option for display settings. In here, just below the monitors, you can go and choose how they act. Make sure it's set to extend or duplicate. If you have it set to show only, only on one, one's going to be black and you may think it's not being detected, but it's just a setting here. So try adjusting that. However, if you find that it's not appearing here, then you can go and scroll down and you can go and press detect and Windows will go and see if it can detect any other display. If that still doesn't solve it, then we're going to open up our graphics card settings here. So I use a NVIDIA one, so I can go and type in NVIDIA control panel and open it up. In here, we can go and make sure that it's enabled. Come to the left and select set up multiple displays and make sure they're both enabled here. And if you can't see one here, press my display is not shown at the bottom and you can do a rigorous display detection. And hopefully that will then go and find it. If you found this useful, then leave a like.